Hello beautiful and welcome to Makeups. The reason I started doing makeups is because of the goddess Nikki tutorials. So let us celebrate the queen. The necessity for sin stick and foundations is at an all time high. I would say that I'm sweet enough but we all know that I'm a bitter betty. Which is why this palette is stolen from my sister's collection. Because that's what sisters do. They just use as many brushes and colors as possible to give us a completely new eye shape. And then cut a crease so sharp your enemies will defecate. And then of course we must add glitters. Because it is a makeup's crime not to have glitter in a look. I just want to shine like the sun. Tortured device. I feel there's just make everything better. Tops and bottoms. Brows need an attitude injection. Tame my hair, spike my brows. Red, the color of love. In my blood when my sister finds out that I stole her palette. But that is it, we are done. And this is the power of makeups. It is an art form. And it's only catfishing if you lack brain cells. But just remember what Dira's mother always say. Nikki Tutorials is a goddess. And if you can't say something nice, say something so I'm going into the bathroom because I have to pee, right? Well, um, excuse me, sir. Are you, are you, are you, are you finished? I kind of need to use that. Hello, beautiful, and welcome to makeups. Today, mother is going to be doing the voiceover. <laughs> Brace yourselves and welcome to mother. Hello. Oh, thin stick, blush, eyeshadow. Oh, blending, 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 lots of eyeshadow. Oh, this is so fast. Peel up. Oh. I drop you the oh, lashes. So, yep, it's all on. It's all on. You, your hairspray's on. Oh, it's so much, so much. Clouds are on now. Oh yes, a cute little nose. Um, pretty lips. Oh, the slow mo's about to happen. Cute little slow mo. If you can't say something nice, don't say it at all. What? Since when do you say that? Sometimes you gotta look bonkers just so that you can look like you've got your head in the clouds. Wait. I think I skipped a step. Hello beautiful and welcome to makeups. In quarantine my last brain cell went. So I'm going to be filling up these water balloons with body paint and then popping them on my face. Whiz pop bang. But first we just need like a base level of makeups, yes? Only the essentials. Sin stick everything. Eye chalks. The natural ones. Highlight. Liner. Brows. Blush. Highlight. Lips. You know, the essentials. Then we fill the balloons up with paint. And one with glitter. I don't know why I thought this was a good idea. I look like child has vomited rainbow ice cream all over me. <laughs> I don't know who needs to hear this, but here it goes. If someone has wronged you or hurt you and they're apologizing, stop saying, it's fine, it's okay. Because essentially that's saying that you forgive them and that everything they did is okay and it's all fine and it's water under the bridge. But if at all you're not 100% okay to forgive them for what they've done, stop saying it. Cause you're not okay with what they did. Instead say, I know, I know you are. Because that lets them know that you acknowledge their apology, but at the same time, you're not in the place to 100% forgive what they've done. Also, their response can really help you sift out the toxic people in your life. Because a healthy person will acknowledge that it's not on you to forgive them, it's on them to gain back your trust and respect and all those kind of things that come with, like, doing something nasty, right? I'm not giving specifications to the nasty because, yeah, it's, it's a personal thing, yeah? But a toxic person will keep drilling home that they're sorry until you say, I know, it's fine. For example. I'm so sorry for what I did. I know you are. Oh, but, but I'm, I, I, I'm so sorry for what I did. But I said I'm sorry. Hello, beautiful, and welcome to makeups. It is time to test our brains. Not that I really have many to begin with. First, we must eliminate any evidence of our natural skin. Perfect. Nightmare fuel. Then bring back some of your natural face shapes. Because oblong isn't exactly how I want to describe my face. Now just start filling our face up with ink blotties. If you thought eyeliner was tough. Oh boy, bright eye, please behave. I 100% know that if Herman Rorschach was alive today, he would be saying, Peel off, you are stunning, but you are unhinged. Like, are you okay? <laughs> oh, Herman, you silly Billy. I'm like everyone else on social media. A narcissist. But that is it, we are done. So tell me, what do you see? And just remember what your mother always say. If you can't say something nice, say something cruel. I just see an angry little bunny on my nose. 
I just did hands down the stupidest thing. Like I've done some dumb stuff, including accidentally chloroforming myself, and yet I think this is stupider. I'm supposed to start editing for my YouTube video that's supposed to go up for tonight, and what you can't see is in there is a big wad of blue tack that I left on my laptop and shut the freaking Ah So if anyone has any advice as to how to open the laptop without, I don't know, breaking it, oh, that would be great because I don't know. <laughs> Who puts blue? Who puts blue tack on their laptop and closes it? <laughs> okay, so my tech friend isn't messaging me or calling me back, so it looks like we're going for this idea. <laughs> I am trying to force open my laptop. Cause I got a big one of blue tack stuck between it. <laughs> okay, it's like it doesn't sound promising. Oh, what did I click? I don't like it. I don't like it. I don't like it. I think it's cut on something. Caught on something. It's hurting my- You! I genius! It's open! It's open! Okay, yeah, the laptop's filthy, but like that and that, it's just- It's- I just- Oh my god! You, you are a legend. You are a genius. Ah, thank you so, so much. You just saved me $1,600. Yay! Now the like real question is, is uh, did I break the screen whilst I was yanking it apart before? I think she does it! Yes! Woo! That was stressful for no reason. Why did I put blue tech on her in the first place? Hello, beautiful, and welcome to Makeups. Gemini, if you see this first, this is your horoscope. Neptune, she's on your horizon. And I am so sorry. Because Spotify, she is broken. And I mean broken. And the only place you can listen to your favorite tunes is the radio. But on every single station, all you can hear is country covers of Nickelback. Look at this photograph. And that is it. I am so glad I'm not a Gemini. But just like that, you are done. Gemini, you are a golden god. But your radio stations... But regardless, don't forget to go out there in the world and show them how stunning you are. And while you're out there, don't forget what your mother always say. If you can't say something nice, say something cruel. Hello, beautiful, and welcome to Makeups. Aquarius, if you see this first, this is your horoscope. A black hole has opened up and it is coming to swallow you whole. And this could be the best opportunity of your life. Or it could not, because the incredible Nicolas Cage wants to make a feature film with you based on the last TikTok that you posted. For my own sake, I am begging it's not Thirst Trap the movie. But just like that, you are done. So don't forget to look stunning. And for everyone's safety, delete some of your last TikToks. And while you're out there in the world, don't forget what your mother always say. If you can't say something nice, Say something cruel! Hello beautiful and welcome to Makeups. Virgo, if you see this first, this is your horoscope. Unfortunately, Uranus has aligned itself with you today. Because today you have to go to a CVS. But while you're waiting in line to pay, who do you see? The absolute legend Timothée Chamolet! And it would be your lucky day, but... And I mean but... But you are getting some industrial strength laxatives. And they drop all over the floor. And of course, he sees. But just like that, you are done. So don't forget to look stunning. And Virgos, maybe just stay in the house. But if you do go out in the world, just remember what your mother always say. If you can't say something nice, say something cruel. Hello, beautiful, and welcome to Makeups. Leos, if you see this first, this is your horoscope. Reality is collapsing as the stars around you go supernova. Because unfortunately for you, Cannibal Shia LaBeouf never told you to just do it! And now that I've given you this revelation, you're wondering, what is the it I'm supposed to do? But just like that, you are done. So don't forget to look stunning and listen to the wise words of the cannibal himself. And also, dear mother, because as she always say, if you can't say something nice, say something cruel. Hello, beautiful, and welcome to Makeups. Cancer, if you see this first, this is your horoscope. Today, the sun is orbiting you. And this one is going to hurt. Because tomorrow you are going to wake up with absolutely no recollection of the night before to find live, laugh, love spelt with F's instead of the V's and the G-H's. So live, laugh, love permanently across your forehead. And no amount of makeups can cover it. And no amount of laser will get rid of it. So you are stuck with it forever. But just like that, we are done. So don't forget to look stunning, even though you have a little something on your face.
But while you're out there in the world, don't forget what your mother always say. If you can't, say something nice. Say something cruel. Hello, beautiful, and welcome to Makeups. Aries, if you see this first, this is your horoscope. The stars have aligned for you today. And I mean literally, the stars. Because Dwayne The Rock Johnson is going to be showing up to your house. And he is coming for your gravel and bitumen. And you will stand there in shock and ask him, Mr. The Rock, why are you at my house? And why are you stealing my bitumen? He will just simply tell you, I just, I want to be whole again. But just like that, you are done. So don't forget to look stunning. And remember, stealing gravel is thirsty work. So of course, be a good host and offer a glass of water. And while you're out there in the world, don't forget what your mother always say. If you can't, say something nice. Say something cruel. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie. I was too lazy to finish the Zodiac series on TikTok, but I did finish it on YouTube. So half a win for JJ. Whoop, whoop. I've been sitting in this car seat for the last half hour, driving to Kmart. And that's been in the door the whole entire time. <laughs> Burn it. Hello, beautiful. I'm not going to put in my brother in drag. <laughs> there ain't enough glue in the world to get rid of these bad boys. <laughs> and that is it for the makeup look. <laughs> Thought it was allergies. Turns out no. Depression. Depression. <laughs> <laughs> you look like Trixie had a really bad day. <laughs> Okay, I'm not gonna lie, left eye don't look too bad. Right eye, she's she's just having a day. She's basic and basic. Good sentencing. <laughs> One set of lashes? No, no, no. We needed five. Clown got his wheelness. Yes, queen. <laughs> okay, it's okay. We're almost there. It's only been five hours. That's okay, right? I'm hungry. We get pooped soon. I'm so sorry. Are you ready for a reveal? <laughs> Oh, so glamorous. Ew! <laughs> how you feel? I feel great. Yeah! I don't know how to cook, so let's make a crockin' bush. <laughs> One of these bad boys. You know, something simple, right? Now we starting to look professional. 12 egg yolks, done. Hot beanie milk, questionable. Mix them all together. I don't know what I'm doing. I think I just made a really fancy scrambled egg. <laughs> Custard mixture is rapidly cooling. Oh, no, I did this right. Custard is cooling. Now just time for the pastry. <laughs> Like, it doesn't look incorrect. It just doesn't look correct. Ooh. They look like anemic turds. What? Done! <laughs> now time to make caramel. Let's place bets on how many times I'm gonna burn myself. Caramel's done, let's go! Surprise, surprise, if you said none, you win! I really thought I was gonna burn myself. I started this one o'clock and we are finally finishing! And here she is, the glorious crock and boosh! I did it, I did it, I did it, I did it! I smashed it! Like, it doesn't look the best, but at the same time, it's the taste that counts, right? Ah! Darling, today we do high fashion. I'm sorry, but every high fashion run my model looks like this, so let's go. Conceal the fact that you have natural skin texture, because that is not fashion. Then just grab any random color, any random brush, and then just start painting that bad boy on. As long as the colors clash and they have no sequence, I don't mind. Do whatever you want to do. Just make sure it doesn't make sense. Then fluff up them brows like your life depends on it. Then once you've put on a cute coat of mascara, do a dumb thing and put some eyeshadow over the top. <laughs> or be smart and just buy some coloured mascara. But I didn't think ahead, so whatever. Makeup is perfect. <laughs> now I just gotta tease my hair like my life depends on it. Just keep going. Then just add some accessories. I chose the trash bag because, like, accurate. And just snap and edit your photo. Boom! You is a model. <laughs> Look, it does not make sense to me, but, uh, at the same time, this would totally be on, like, a Vogue magazine cover. One person's chaos is another person's fashion! Put a finger down if when you're at university studying chemistry, while you were doing a lab session, the university swapped one of the chemicals you were using last minute. So instead of dissolving this random white powder and some tetrachloromethane on a hot plate out of the fume hood, you were told to use trichloromethane, also known as chloroform. But we didn't know that. So essentially you and eight other people hotboxed the whole entire laboratory with chloroform. Until your amazing friend Maria said, JJ, what are you doing? And you of course replied to her with, I'm heating up the clear liquid like we're supposed to. And Maria being the absolute legend she is, lets you know, hey, JJ, that's chloroform. That should be in the fume hood. And after the lab, you went back to your car and had an eight hour nap, making your family fear that you're dead because you didn't come home when you usually do. In summary, put a finger down if you chloroformed yourself. And put a finger down if you graduated. 
Over the years, I've convinced myself that I'm the Chandler of every friend group. <laughs> That's such a lie. Because this new industrial bucket is my favorite thing I've ever bought. Look at how beautiful I can mop the floors and clean that grout. Oh, the satisfaction. Hello, beautiful, and welcome to makeup. I have waited so long for this palette to arrive. She finally came in the mail, so let's have some fun. How does she swatch? Fabulously. Oh my gosh. There's holy glitter. I love holy glitter. Prepare your base. That way all the beautiful colors pop through. We're going to be doing a split look. We're going to be doing this side natural and this side extravagant. That way we can see how versatile this is. Because even though I'm biased because I love Selena, we still got to like have some sense of education. Right. A cute shot for depth. Euphoria and DM me for shimmer. Boom. The words. Right side, your turn, baby cakes. Thank you. No, thank you. I am the Emerald City, but we gotta add some glitter because, like, it's glitter. Ectoplasm, buckle up, buttercup. Let's go. Okay, so it's called ectoplasm because it's out of this world? Is that it? Then feathers, contour, highlight, lips. Boom! On a scale of fake pockets to nachos, this is breakfast. Because it's essential. <laughs> Today we are roasting my old high school photos. I know. This is my year seven high school photo. <laughs> Why did my mom let me leave the house? Photo quality is terrible, but it's all I got. But if you look closely, you can see my messed up teeth. She looks better, but also like hot diggity dang. <laughs> my you turned informal. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> we as a model. The worst part about this dress is it's a mullet dress. So many things wrong with this. This one I'm actually quite proud of. What you can't see is Squirtles over there and Bulbasaur's over there. I paper mache these heads myself with the help of my friend Jessie and we looked incredible. I don't remember what it was for, but we look dope. My year 12 high school photo. I look terrified. And that's on Catholic schools. I'm a quirky girl. <laughs> Me and my year 12 full. She's got a teeny bit better. I want a mullet dress. But as you can see here, I had no concept of how to do makeup. And I insisted on doing it myself. What you can't see is my wrist is actually broken, so I have a cast. Because my ex-best friend crashed and I can't break it. I bought my own acrylic nail set. I don't see how this could possibly go wrong. At the moment, the way that the world is like going outside is maybe not the best idea. So, Desmond, time come with Desmond measures. You could either call these Rona nails or anxiety nails. Take your pick. And now, and now, no, it's so ugly. Now it's just time for the other nine. Can't get much worse. I need right hand first because I'm right hand dominant and um, oh, oh no. Just look at that. <laughs> There's only so much you can buff things out and cover it with nail polish. Erase left hand can't get any worse. It got worse. To hide the fact that I've done these nails myself, I decided to get myself some polish to go over the top that just screams subtle. So we got pearlescent and purple and black. <laughs> it could have been worse. I could have picked beige. I fell asleep. On camera they don't look bad, but in person. Visual food poisoning. Tell me this. What color would I get when I mix all of my 656 eyeshadows together? I guess we're gonna find out. Thank you for your sacrifice. We are halfway through. And doesn't she look beautiful? I just don't want it to be brown, or like gray, or just some sort of neutral, because that's just so boring. All of my shadows have finally been scraped. So this is how she looks like before I mix her. Let me know what color you think it's gonna be. But don't worry, you're gonna see the reveal in the video too. I made dirt. Ice purple alcohol to bring it all together. And you get mud. It's just gonna be sparkly freaking mud. Mmm, forbidden chocolate mousse. Has evaporated, I look like a naked mole rat. So let's see what color it is. We got purple! Yes! The rest of the face is now on and we look so cute! Let me know in the comments what you want to call this beautiful, glorious hybrid shade. Because if you don't stop me, I'm calling it Greg. I looked in the mirror and wondered to myself, why am I so pink? Like, did I eat my allergies again? Tomato. Capsicum. Chili. Eggplant. White potato. <laughs> no, no, no. I covered my face in purple and pink eyeshadow yesterday and it stains. <laughs> I can't exfoliate again. I want enough skin. Hello, beautiful. And we're gonna make up. First step, make our brows like our social life. Non-existent. And then use a foundation color that completely matches our skin tone. To paste it! This white face paint is all kinds of ugh. So trying to blend this out is not going well. She's looking chalker. Then with these cute little stencils, pack on the color. Don't rub, pack. And then we just, ah, it looks so cute. Snowflake blush is gonna be like the next new thing and you're welcome. Now we just got a Tim Burton, this bad boy. I've really got to get better body paint. Liquid lipstick coming in for the win. Oh, Tim Burton wishes he could. Kind of looking corpse bar, but still good. Now we just got to get the little charcoal lips. Illusion on, so time for the nose. Just some tinfoil tape and some paint. 
Frosty the Snowman. And just like that, you are done. But don't forget to go out there in the world and show them how stunning you are. And while you're out there, don't forget what your mother always says. If you can't, say something nice. Say something cruel. Hello, and welcome to makeup. Hello, a lot of difference two years can make. Just look at that! I'm incredible. But also, I have hair! Hello, and welcome to makeups. First tip, concealer. Concealer covers sin. Peel off has lots of sin. And find eye chalk. Find natural colors. You're naturally beautiful. Enhance natural. I naturally want to be a flamingo. Then blend like it is Olympic event. Add glitter. Enemies are blinded by your beauty and in the sun because of shiny. Highlight important sections. Resist urge to highlight entire face. Take ink to eyelid. Wing it like everything in your life. Time for torture. Yee! Eye feathers. Ooh. Wait impatiently. <sighs> I don't understand. Is stuck. Convince the world you've seen the sun at least once in your lifetime. Highlight again. Mm. Paint lips. <laughs> you are done. So don't forget to look sexy. And remember what your mother always say. If you can't say something nice, say something cruel.